Gwendolyn, I must get Chris and at once. I think we must get married at once. There's no time to be lost. Married, Mr. Burling? The reason why I think that, um, Ernest likes Gwendolyn is that, um, why would we like anyone ever? Gwendolyn is more of the aggressor, really. His character is more of the, like, nervous, shy, like, not so sure. Well, surely, you, you know that I love you and you led me to believe, Miss Fairfax, that you're not absolutely indifferent to me. I adore you, but you haven't proposed to me yet. Nothing has been said at all about marriage. The subject has not been touched on. And he also wants to buy into society, because even though he has a townhouse in the country, he has a townhouse and he also has a country house, he needs a bit of social status to live in London yes. and to be able to go around and say, yes, I'm related to the Brackpoles. And spare you any possible disappointment, Mr. Worthing. I feel it only fair to tell you quite frankly beforehand that I'm fully determined to accept you. Go on, Lily. Yes, Mr. Worthing, what have you got to say to me? She loves the attention that he gives to her. She loves the doting that he has. And she's just always, uh, it's mostly she loves his name, really. It, the name is what first attracted her to him, and ever since then, she's just kind of ran with it. What wonderfully green eyes you have, Ernest. They're quite, quite green. I hope you will always look at me just like that, especially when there are other people present. Like, I, I don't know why Gwendolyn likes um, Ernest, or Jack, or John, because Gwendolyn is a mystery as most women are.